Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm making this beautiful frog painting with alcohol ink and alcohol ink markers. So let's do step by step. I will show you how to make this beautiful painting. Before we start, I just want to let you know there are some safety tips on alcohol ink art. Make sure to pause the video and read it. And for this uh, painting, I'm using this ultra premium uh, photo paper high gloss from Staples. But you can make the same painting in Nara paper or Upo or any other synthetic paper that you have. And for blending the alcohol inks, I'm using this solution called isopropyl alcohol. I'll show you in just a minute. Yeah, this is the isopropyl alcohol I got from pharmacy store 91% it says in the bottle that's what I use and I put that uh, in a small bottle which I got from Amazon this has a tiny nozzle so it's easy to pour the isopropyl alcohol and I use the back side of the photo paper because it, the alcohol inks flow easily on the back side and first I make a rough drawing of a frog using a fine liner marker so this marker is also be alcohol ink based so even if uh, we put isopropyl alcohol it blends easily so that's why i'm using this uh, fine liner marker but otherwise you can use some pencil or something like that colored pencil And if this is your first time coming to my channel, please subscribe because I post videos every single day. So if you click subscribe and hit the notification bell, then you will get notified when I post new videos. The colors I'm using are botanical green and uh, glacier. So I use a piece of wax paper as a roll and then apply it on to the drawing paper. First I use botanical green. And if you want to make the color lighter, just uh, add some isopropyl alcohol. I apply just uh, dots on the drawing.
Now I add another color called Glacier. It's almost like blue. So I add that and sometimes I dilute with uh, isopropyl alcohol to make it lighter. And then I follow the same process of applying with a wax paper. And this color I'm using is called a calabaza orange. You can use any kind of orange, but I had this orange. So again, I'm mixing with little isopropyl alcohol and adding it uh, for the orange color. And the color I'm using now is called the teak wood. So it's basically a wood color. I dilute it again with isopropyl alcohol to make it light wood color. And then I'm applying it to the body.
is Kali Art Art Markers, which are alcohol ink based markers. I use that for fine details and outlines and things like that. The speciality of this marker is it blends with isopropyl alcohol. So that's why I'm using this uh, alcohol ink based markers. You can try any brand, but I.
Thank you.